We'll talk about that in just a second. I want to show you what's happening right now. A very somber moment here as a CAL FIRE crew searches through what's left of a mangled car that's wrapped around a tree here on East Valley Lane. They are searching to make sure that there is no one inside. At this point, it would be a body. They have to make sure. And what you're looking at was a Toyota Camry. The devastation on this block is horrific. House after house. Down the street, I wanted to show you that, but I want to stay with this right now. These men and women have a very grim task. They told me they're going to search every single car to make sure there is no one inside. And that is because, as you mentioned, those numbers, five people are still missing, unaccounted for. The number fluctuates. It was 43 yesterday. Luckily, they found a lot of those people. And now it's at five with 17 confirmed dead. Three people in the hospital in critical condition. There are many people in the hospital, but three are in critical condition. And Carlos, I'm going to ask you while they do that, let's, let's pan off over there. I don't know if you can see it with the sun. The front of that house completely torn off. It's just gone. It's down the street. And a lot of stuff has just been taken down the street. And I'm going to ask my photographer, Carlos, to walk with me and try to show you this house here on the 1700 block of East Valley. And the water continues to run here on the street. And they're concerned. They told me today that more mud is going to continue to come down. There are broken fire hydrants throughout town. And take a look at this house. This was a circular driveway. Now it's covered with boulders. And I want you to look at this brand new Volkswagen that's flown up on top of a garage. There's actually a car underneath it. So you can tell that the car wasn't in the garage. Take a look at that. Photographer Carlos Baltadano, bear with us. These are very large homes and the, the division between them is great. And if we have a moment, I'm gonna ask Carlos to follow me down the street because I just, I want to show you something. It's the pieces of people's lives, 17 lives lost. And hopefully all these people evacuated because I found a children's bedroom, the entire bedroom in the street. Stuffed animals, blankets, everything is just in the middle of the street down here. And it's horrific to look at because we know that there are children among the dead, including three-year-old Haley Benitez. We don't know where she lived. We pray and hope that everyone got out of this area safe. And look at the water just continuing to run and take with it the mud. And we're almost there. Just bear with me. It really gives you a sense of the horror, of the force of this storm. And here we go. This is a child's bedroom. Look at this. This is a mattress. Look at the stuffed animals on the floor. And, and this just gives you a little bit of perspective of the horror that the people here in Montecito have lived through. And again, five people still unaccounted for. They are actively searching as that CAL FIRE crew, and we pray that they don't find anybody inside what's left of that car. So just a first-hand look at what's happening here, and the horror continues. Reporting live, I'm Gigi Gracia. We'll send it back to you. And the hope.